Hi, I'm Matt Ho. We're doing 15 issues in 15 days. Today's day 13 and today's issue is energy. North Carolina consumes almost four times more energy than it produces. Coal-powered electrical plants create coal ash that gets stored in leaky slurry ponds, which leak into local water supply, which, as we well know, has happened with tremendous consequences for the environment and people's health. We must get away from the use of fossil fuels and invest in renewable resources. It's not hyperbole to say our future depends upon it. We are experiencing climate collapse now and it is worsening. We need to ban fracking and other destructive fossil fuel extraction techniques like tar sand mining, offshore drilling, mountaintop removal, and coal mining. And we must end construction of new fossil fuel infrastructure like pipelines and storage facilities. The deals made by the Biden administration to expand the fossil fuel industry are suicide packs. In 2020, solar power provided about 7% of the state's total electrical generation, and wind energy supplied just 0.4%. We need to incentivize and subsidize on and offshore wind farming, localized solar farming, and other emerging green energy technologies, such as tidal power and green, and green hydrogen, as well as investment in smart grid technology. We also need to invest in public utilities, including purchasing controlling interest in currently private utilities to bring them under local democratic control. All this needs to be done through a massive government-led effort, akin to the World War II industrial effort, through a Green New Deal that will invest trillions in reclaiming, reimagining, and rebuilding our energy and economic infrastructure to mitigate and assimilate to climate change while creating millions of high-paying jobs in a revolutionized American economy. We cannot delay any further on this. In fact, when I talk about these things, what I often say is, if we're serious about this, we need to build a time machine and go back 40 or 50 years because we are that far behind on it. We can't delay any further. I'm Matt Ho. I'll talk to you tomorrow.